Uh, I think the answer as it relates to WTO in particular is no and yes. Uh, no in the sense that uh, WTO is a very uh, uh, vibrant institution that has a very well functioning dispute settlement mechanism. Uh, the decisions of the panels are overwhelmingly enforced. Uh, also, the WTO uh, performs very well a surveillance fu uh, function, uh, and that is alive and well. Uh, the WTO is, uh, continues to be very attractive uh, to members. Uh, we have a, uh, an important array of members who would like to become uh, part of the organization, and most recently, I believe China's uh, incorporation uh, shows that, uh, uh, that there is value in being a member of the WTO. Um, and finally, the WTO has been uh, uh, very effectively uh, uh, reinventing itself, for instance, uh, to continue to, pro uh, to uh, promote uh, development, uh, in this case through the Aid for Trade Initiative. So in many senses, um, the multilateralism as it relates to WTO is not in crisis. Now the negotiating function of the WTO uh, is certainly going through difficult times. Uh, it's certainly going through difficult times because the Doha round has taken uh, a lot of time uh, and there is no agreement as to how to conclude uh, the negotiations. In the meantime, uh, negotiations are taking place at the uh, bilateral, at the regional level, and, uh, and I believe that it is important to reflect upon this uh, because there are many problems that are global in nature, including some in the, in the area of trade, and it is important uh, to revitalize the WTO by bringing uh, the negotiating function uh, back to play a central role in the organization.